We're playing Impossible Who's That Pokemon, and whoever catches the right Pokemon gets a point. Who's that Pokemon? That looks like Gengar. <sighs> But we've done this before, uh -huh. and I know it's going to be some other nonsense. I can tell you for sure that is not Gengar. I'd be shocked if we get it right. I'll be shocked if we get any of them right. The last time we did this, you got a single one right, and I got none. Flashback. Ah! End of flashback. Yeah, for that reason, this is not going to cover the JMC. It's a bonus episode. We're just seeing if we can get any of these right. But if you want to see the rest of the JMC, subscribe to the channel so you don't miss it when it comes back. But for now, I have a very good bad idea, Mikey. Okay. The first viral video I ever made, I actually talked about how Gengar is the shadow of Clefable. I need to go for Clefable. Why do you have to go for a Pokemon? It's gonna take forever for you to friggin' find. What if I'm right? What if I'm just- There is no way it's that obvious. Come on! I feel like it's gotta be something that has at least a spike. Oh, I went to Cerulean Cave. I insert meme of Mikey that just says, I am dumb boy. Hell yeah! Did you say that it couldn't be Clefable? I didn't think it could be Clefable. But last time- it was Clefairy, and Clefairy has the little baby wings that wouldn't pr protrude like Clefable. I think they're trying to pull the ultimate joke, Mikey. I think you're dumb. <laughs> Come on. Well, what are you getting? Uh, I'm catching Hypno. <laughs> I know the drowsy meme is the thing, obviously. This is not the same. And also I thought maybe it's like a hypno that's like looking up and also very fat. I got it. Are you ready? It is a... <laughs> what? That's actually so clever. It's so round. I mean, it is a very rotund syndical. I think we knew it was going to be rotund no matter what. Why is this so perfect? I'm not mad. I'm sure that will last. <laughs> <laughs> Who's that Pokemon? Oh, I hate how that tail works. With how round the top of it is, I feel like you could fit like any Pokemon there. Oh, 100%. And especially knowing that like there could be an arm reaching across the middle of that that we just will never see. I'm upset. I'm upset because I know that I have no chance. Decided on something and it uh, is in a game that I don't have in my Switch right now. Sorry, I'll be right back. Wait a second. This is the perfect time to sneak in a game of Pokemon Unite as this video is actually sponsored by the Pokemon Company International. The EV Festival in Pokemon Unite is happening right now, and I've been having way too much fun with it. What is going on? I just can't stop playing the EV Appealorama mode, and with Mikey gone, I think I can sneak in a quick win with my pal Sylveon. I can't find it! Not only do you get to play as Eevee in one of its evolutions in this quick battle mode, but you also have a chance to obtain prizes such as Unite licensed puzzle pieces for Sylveon, Glaceon, and Espeon. And considering that those allow you to unlock the license for those Pokemon, I've been working hard to make sure I unlock Sylveon before the event ends. I'm the best Sylveon here. We all know this. It's too easy. Way too easy. Umbreon is also available now, and Leafeon will be available on June 8th. Mm, I don't know where it is. Adorable checkered style hollowware for the EV evolutions is available now, which is perfect because you can't just be running around Pokemon Unite without any hollowware on. When I eventually unlock Sylveon, I might have to get that hollowware. But the night style also looks pretty cool, so maybe I'll grab both of them. So make sure you click the link below and get Unite today, which is free to start on iOS, Android, and Nintendo Switch. Back to the drawing board. Well, I mean, I, I just can't use Let's Go Pikachu. That's my only limitation. See, this is a competition that's really going to expose how highly we think of ourselves, of like, do we really think we can do this? Now I'm worried the Pokemon I wanted to guess is just not here. Um, calling an audible. Are you okay? Are you falling apart? I'm flustered man. I don't know where my games are. Oh, yeah. Well, I can go back to playing in uh, Gen 9. I can find my classic shiny. I, I didn't even tell you. When we were talking before the video, I found a shiny. What? What was it? It was a Slitherwing. That's a very cool one. <laughs> well, anyways, I can tell you what I got. You can't get it. You're not allowed. I got Pile of Swine. Oh, but that's my friend. I'm a home wrecker. There's nothing you can do about it. Why are you exploding? It's not one of those competitions where that does anything but hurt my feelings. <laughs> if this thing explodes and doesn't get into the quick ball, I can't be held responsible for the things that I say. You're just an old willy wop. All right, Mikey. Are you ready to be shocked and amazed by my genius? No. <laughs> <laughs> we should have known. It's the same animal. We known. It's the same animal. <laughs> we should have known. Hachiri supersize me. Who's that Pokemon? Oh, whoa. What if it really is? What? What? What if one of these is just the Pokemon? Let I'd be. 
pissed. No, I know what this is. I have false confidence. I'm running towards it. I'm running too, and in fact, I'm already in battle with it. What? It spawned right next to the fly point. <laughs> and the quick ball worked. Look at that. All right, now I get to sit back, relax, and all cool. Try and play some b-ball outside the school. Hope there's not a couple of guys that are up to no good. Started making trouble in my neighborhood. I'm still trying to figure out how you went from what could this be to I caught it in like five seconds. The key to my happiness in this video recording is for me to just go with the first thing that pops into my head and expect nothing. Now this is your mistake. This is when I swoop in. I'm going to get 10 of them right. Mikey, 10 of them. Just then. Why is it only Spiro? What are you doing? I'm getting the winning Pokemon. Are you in Let's Go? Looking for Nido King or Nido Queen? Possibly, yes. Quit doing that. I already caught Nido King. What about Nido Queen? Okay, well then go to the Crown Tundra. <sighs> I never bought the expansion pass on this new Switch. <laughs> Uh, that makes me feel better about not knowing where my freaking Let's Go cartridge is. Do I buy it or do I just really go for something crazy? Go for something crazy, man. I'm not gonna wait for that to download. I am quite upset at how this has gone because I felt like I didn't answer very quickly and then you had the same one because I'm not that special. What did you get? I went with Haxorus. They like to make all the Pokemon a little portly, so maybe it's just portly Haxorus. No way, but sure. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Oh, we are, we, oh, we are on the right track. A Gen 1 bipedal spiky armored thing. If I just stayed in Let's Go, no, because it would have been hard to catch there anyways. Let's Go the only place? Could I literally have not caught it? <laughs> Okay, I got a hold of my girlfriend's Let's Go Eevee, so I can catch Let's Go Pokemon now. Who's that Pokemon? That could be anything. That could be <laughs> that could be anything. From true belief that I got it to that could be anything, here we are. We just need to believe I got it. It's a cupcake. I can see that it's a cupcake, but there's no cupcake Pokemon. You buy me a cupcake, I eat the cupcake. Okay. Um Mikey, this could literally be anything. Order online. <laughs> There's a double bunklet tower. Is this food? Yeah. Are you trying to poison me? Yeah. No, I uh, no. I mean, no. <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> I'm going to kill you. Um, custom message card. I am a dumb boy. Am I supposed to be finding my Pokemon throughout all this? <laughs> oh no, the minimum order value for delivery is $24. I'm just gonna get you a cake. Does this mean I don't get to find out what a buntlet is? I'm giving you the double buntlet tower and the cake. <laughs> what? Hold on, my credit card's downstairs. <sighs> I always said the JMC was a long con to get a free cake out of him, so I'm glad Glad it's okay. finally coming true. Oh, I'm getting so sweaty. I'm glad you didn't hear what I just said. Your delivery is confirmed. It won't get there till uh, tomorrow. <laughs> Anyways, uh, my Pokemon. Um, See, it was a cupcake and then it turned into a buntlet and then it turned into a cake. And then I said, you know what? I think it's a fortress. All right, uh, I have spent entirely too long doing this. Um, I'm catching a Rattata just cause it's nearby. <laughs> Why do all these Pokemon keep exploding? John, how is it after that whole cake buying ordeal? I caught my Pokemon before you. Why is my party five Caterpies and a Hypno? Well, that says more about you than it does about me, okay? Mikey, if this fortress blows up on me. <laughs> Woo, okay. I do have some confidence in this gas spot. All right, I'm ready. I almost went with Ghastly. I almost went with Ghastly. I feel like we're learning we always need to catch Ghastly at least once. I, I, I'm so upset. I thought Ghastly. I'm so, I'm so upset. Who's that Pokemon? Whoa, what the heck? Wait, how do you make something look like Charizard? You light its tail on fire and uh, tell it to take to the skies. It's gotta be a pretty fearsome creature. It's got to be winged. Part of me wants to go catch Ghastly and live with the consequences. They're not gonna repeat. I have an idea. Hold on to that optimism, John. Pokemon come in all shapes and sizes, Mikey. I'm just catching some with wings. I don't feel confident, and for some reason that's making me feel more confident because every time I'm confident, I'm wrong. Every time you're wrong, just no matter what. Well, let's be nice. Yeah. Let's be nice. Not no matter. I mean, some, I, it's like once. I caught mine. I'm going to prove you wrong. Yeah, and then you're going to eat a crow. I caught a crow. I caught Corviknight. It's weird that you said that specific thing when I caught a Corviknight. I got Dragonite, okay? It's it's an adorable guy, and I don't want it to change, but it just may have lost a few pounds, and that's okay. I considered Dragonite, but I was thinking like, ooh, what if the... Charizard's horn is now a bird beak. Oh, what is that? Is that? <laughs> are, are you kidding me? <laughs> I kind of respect it from a lore standpoint. I also respect the weird amount of people who are lying in the comments saying they got that right. You didn't. Who's that Pokemon? 
All right. <laughs> I'm so angry. It's going gonna, it's gonna to be Voltorb somehow. This is the most specific silhouette. You're not going to trick me to catch Voltorb, but I'm like strongly considering it. Wow, you really are broken. I really thought about Ghastly on the one that turned out to be Ghastly, and I'm quickly realizing that might have been my best shot. There's a reason we're not having this officially part of the JMC, John. Us finishing 0-0 zero, zero is not only possible, it is probable. I caught Toad's Cruel. I had a thought, and I don't think it's necessarily a great one. As Socrates once said, bugs, catch them. Socrates, no. Shut up! Not like you said, and as my, my boy Socrates said, I'm gonna catch the bug, and it's Tarantula. Ooh. Instead of the the web in the back, or just the, the spindly, spindly yarn being spherical, it could be cubical. So instead of Tarantula. The square chilla. To rectangular. Neither of ours were good. Let's, yeah, we'll, okay. <laughs> We can't even catch Mewtwo! Oh, Why are we catching things if there's gonna be Pokemon in this that we can't even catch? <laughs> no, Sword and Shield, uh, the dead rage. Oh yeah, let me just go for the, the freaking. You could have put anything in that box. How could they do this to us? <laughs> Who's that Pokemon? I'm gonna go with Katie. Katie gave me the answer to this the other day. Like, are you cheating or she just guessed? We were watching the Pokemon anime together as, as friends do. And she told me that she always thought Ho-Oh was something else. Oh. And when was the last time a, a child was wrong about anything? How do I word this correctly? Like the most recent point in time at all times. <laughs> <laughs> what is the most incorrect thing? The first Pokemon game you played, what was like the, the thing you were most incorrect about. You know how in the games, if it's a Pokemon you've caught before, it has a little Pokeball emblem on its like HP bar. I remember noticing that for the first time, playing Ruby for the first time and being like, oh, that means this Pokemon was abandoned. <laughs> Oh no. Which is fully incorrect, obviously. In the first episode of the anime, Ho-Oh flies across the sky. It was Gen 1 back then, so it couldn't be a Ho-Oh. It had to be a Fero. Katie is correct. I caught mine. I caught Halucha. I just went to Area Zero and caught the first bird I saw. It was a Halucha with a really long neck, I'm realizing. Right. <laughs> <laughs> What's upsetting me most is you catching the first bird you saw was the right strategy. They just took Squawkabilly and made it legendary. Who's that Pokemon? I'm furious. I'm already furious because I look at that and I see Staryu. Oh, I think the same thing. But what if it is Staryu? Okay, well, we have to decide who's going to go get it now. Well, I have Let's Go and you don't. I do have it now. Mm, that is true. Okay. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. What did you put? Scissors. Oh, well, look at that. I put rock. Good luck getting Staryu. What if it's just like a cat turn from above? Wait a minute. <laughs> or like something else that has some kind of star pattern on its head, like a- Why can't this just be Bronzor, right? Why not us? I think my brain is short circuiting, so. Why don't you long circuit it? It's time to stop, okay? I caught the star, you? Because I won rock, paper, scissors, fair and square. Okay, well, what about, uh, what about Quillfish? Are you serious? I'm catching the Quillfish, Mikey. You got Starfish. I got Quillfish. Together they make Starlord. Star Does Quillfish also explode? <laughs> Probably. I don't know, but it's round like a bomb. Okay, I caught it. All right, thank God. Okay, let's let's see what this is. Oh my <laughs> God. I mean, it is it is designed to be somewhat reminiscent of a star. My face hurts from smiling, but on the inside, I'm broken. Who's that? How? How? Mikey, how? Uh, beats me. I have an idea and I am committing. That's not gonna happen for me. I don't know, I don't, what, how? I keep forgetting this game, you only use one hand. Wait, I know. What is it? Well, I, I can't tell you, cause what if, what if you're getting it? Then I'd have to come up with a new idea and I'm too lazy to do that. Well, all right, you can say it. And if I am going for the same thing, I will change. Delayed. Nope. That was us clapping or high-fiving. My brain no worky. I need the cake. I really wish it would. I could get something that would arrive during the filming of the video, but instead you just- What if I saved it for the next time I saw you and threw it in your face? That would just ruin my lovely gift. So you're saying if I if I bought like a comical like pie, I could throw that at you instead? Yeah, that would be different, but I bought you an ice cake and you're gonna freaking eat it. I caught my Pokemon, by the way. Running, running, run, running, running, do, 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 do. <laughs> what was that? John, what is- Love. Well, I think love is different for everybody. Wrong, you dumb idiot. The answer is baby, don't hurt me. <laughs> don't hurt me no more. I was gonna say love could even just be a good friendship. That means a lot to you. <laughs>
<laughs> oh boy, who says something like that? Yeah, I got matcha. Why? <laughs> as I said, I just have to go with the first thing that pops into my head. That has worked for you as many times as whatever I'm doing has worked for me, so I respect it. Short glade, short glade, short glade, short glade. No! 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 Oh! I'm looking at a rose! That's wild, you got that close. Uh... <laughs> can I get a pity half point? Yeah, you can have the pity. Who's that Pokemon? Oh no. <laughs> Oh, dude, it's, I couldn't even tell what regular yeah. Pokemon that was for a second. <laughs> I have the stupidest idea I have ever had in one of these. You have never said anything more enticing to me. It is so undeniably stupid, but I'm going to go for it because on the minuscule chance that it is correct, it would be the most legendary guess of all time. Ah, boy, here we go. I haven't found the Pokemon quick. I might switch games to make sure I find it lickety splits. Oh, come on. Are you ready to be amazed by my genius, my brilliance? Uh, uh, yeah, but first let me tell you mine, just because mine's less crazy. I just got Gibble. You see this creature, and you see the mouth, and the hand, and the tail, and you focus on all of that, but that's what they want you to look at. Open your eyes, sheeple. That's a diglet, and around it is the ground, and the rest of it could be anything. It doesn't matter. We don't know what's under the ground with diglet. Oh my god, if you get this. I give myself a, like, a 1% chance. I need to know. I need to know, uh, John. <laughs> No! <laughs> they just made Ludicolo into a silly looking dinosaur. I really wish it was Diglett, man. You know the worst part about this is if we ever do a third one, there will be a Diglett one, and I won't see it coming. Who's that Pokemon? That's a ball. That's just a ball. Yeah, that, that could be any of them. I feel like I kind of have an idea. I have an idea. It's not a good one, but none of them are ever good. Gibble was a good one. It wasn't right. I found my Pokemon. I should catch it because it's low level. I'm going Jigglypuff. The iconic, it's a Jigglypuff. Puff from above. Jigglypuff seen from above. I think this is a Jigglypuff with its ears down or something. It's not a bad idea. I was gonna do Voltorb, but I was like, oh no, it's gotta be a round Pokemon that at least has some limbs. I was gonna do Voltorb too, and then I said, no, it's gonna be coughing, and the limbs at the bottom will be the smoke. Mm. Coughing is in the Haunted Mansion, yes? Yeah, but I think it's a version exclusive. Well, that's gonna hurt my feelings. Are you seeing Grimer and Muck? Ah! I mean, there's always certain shield. Ha ha! Okay, I'm looking at coughing, and the gas is kind of surrounding its body, but it could put and toot just downwards. I just put and toot downwards. You coughing like the same guy. Literally no differences. Both stinky, round <laughs> creatures. And weak to drowsy. Now that I've caught you, Mikey, the stinky ball, let's see what this is. Ah, uh, it could have been any round thing. Oh, I didn't pick the right round thing. This actually, look, beyond the <laughs> the scary growth on its back that I wanted to get checked out, the art actually looks pretty good. Who's that Pokemon? There's no thought in my head. I just stared at that thing. Yeah. And nothing came to me. I have been broken. What Pokemon exist again? I don't even have anything clever. I don't even have anything not funny to say. I got nothing. It's gonna go for Rufflet. And I'm like, wait, it's got two things on its head. Can I rely on your intellect and knowledge of Pokemon? Yes. Could you help me decipher where uh, one Petalil resides? First place I think of is in Legends Arceus, in that flower meadow in the wetlands. Legends Arceus is the play. I thought about it for too long. And just, uh, I caught it. I caught a round-ish thing with ears. Actually, Petalil is actually an easy Pokemon to catch. I can just run up to it and just huck something at it. Were you wrong? Skill issue. No. <laughs> Have I been wrong once this video? Yes. Have I wrong twice this video? Yes. All right, let's just see the answer, smart guy. <laughs> all right, all right. Oh, come on. <laughs> I respect it. I, I, you know what? I, I, I respect it so much. Its ears do actually look like that. If that's the one we're gonna go out on, so be it. So be it indeed. There's no way he actually bought. Does that actually say I am dumb boy? I still don't know what a bun cake is and I won't look it up. I'll only try it. It's pretty good. <laughs> no.